All righty. Sure, Rogers. Of falls here, people. Yeah. <laughs> here it is. I'm feeling it. I'm ready for the scarves. All Love right, it. here we go. Let's get some uh, leg raises here. A little movement, warm up a bit. Breathe. Reach that heel there. All right. What's going on, Rick? How we doing? Good. How are you? Doing good. You're just warming up here. I got the the booties, got the uh, the scarf, hat. Feeling good. Cozy. It's a cozy oh. night. Yeah, I think I think we're in it. All right. And then if we could bring that into a bent leg hamstring or straight leg hamstring if we have a rope a spare scarf oh there we go right i was wearing that hoodie and this could be i like active to start here straight leg up and down there and breathe hey lindy hi hey, hey. yes yeah, so this is the uh, special 25th anniversary edition of sip and stretch not that sip and stretch has been around for 25 years but axis has which is huge inhale today did you get some rick yeah lauren and i were there nice there we go all right gonna switch sides here with that straight leg raise i'm happy did you do yeah good 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 Got it. Got it. Got it. Sorry. I'm back. Rick uh, took over my Zoom there for a second. There you go. It was, it was a close one. It was a close one. It might be a good two minutes of uh, your leg being up in the air, Rick, on this next recording. Just a, just a heads up. Just a heads up. No, sorry about that. I clicked my earbud. All right. Since we already have this straight leg raise, other leg down. So you can come across your body. So it's gonna be straight leg raise, cross body, IT band, glute is what you should feel. You wanna have the other leg straight up towards the ceiling or the sky at the same time there too. What was your uh, favorite taco rig? That's what I was trying to ask. I had one of each, they were all good. Oh, I'm kind of with you right there. Four tacos. I, I'm with you. I did four tacos. Two limes, as much cilantro, radish. Yeah. And I was sweating from those jalapenos. I tried the jalapenos. They were, I they were, the, was, I didn't have them. It's a smart call, Rick, if you want to have just a good <laughs> rest of your day. Okay, let's go back to the first side, side A, do that straight leg raise across the body there since I didn't get to that the first time. Yeah, I think there's different types of spice in that jalapeno, kind of Mexican spice kind of gets into your, you know, goes into your body and then it immediately kind of, you know, you just feel the, the response after that. But it's different from like Thai spicy and you know, there's, there's all sorts of types. Indian spice, a lot of garlic. Hopefully you can tell it's a through before our session tomorrow. <laughs> oh, definitely, definitely. It's, it's all good. I'm, <laughs> uh, I'm built for it. My 23 and me said that <laughs> I, I'm genetically um yeah process as well it's no yogurt let's put it that way all righty here we go let's see if we go face down hands and knees get those cat camels going flex and then extend i was listening to this uh health podcast and they were talking about longevity and you know what they're saying is as we age it's they feel that the research is going in a way where it's best to eat with your ancestral patterns, whatever that means. Mm -hmm. So I guess a lot of that is just could be regional, could be, um, you know, what we are food intolerances. And I think for all of us, it's like anti processed food, which I think we all know and making those, those smart trade-offs there. All right, toes tucked, arms long. I'm hoping jalapeno stays in there for me, though, for as long as possible. Long reach and breathe. But, you know, keeping on that ancestry slash 
spice topic there. I do. This is, this is like the main story that sticks out for me with that is I remember going to this Thai place over here in San Jose. Like how spicy you want it. Give me Thai spicy. Give me the spiciest. And then this, the lady looks over to me. She just goes, it's not for you. So she just completely just, you know, dismissed me. She's like, no, it's not for you. I was like, what? I was like, what do you mean? She's like, it's not for you. <laughs> so it's just meant it exactly like that. You know, it's like, you can just tell. You're not, you're not going to be able to handle it, buddy. So it just give me a little bit. And then I had it. And then I thanked her after that. I was like, thank you. I would have made the wrong choice. It was not what for it, it was not for me. <laughs> just the one hand behind the back. Behind the back hurts. Head or across the shoulder all works to rotate up towards the ceiling or the sky. But yeah, what an expert diagnosis from her prescription. It was, it was great. It's not for you. Okay. But then you just take it as a challenge. Yeah, that's, that's exactly what I heard. And then <laughs> I was immediately refuted. So now I know. That's what they said about the 50K2 wreck. Showed them. Showed them. All righty. Other side there. Elbows in the ground. Hand behind the back. Rotate and turn. Yeah, food challenges. That's right. I forgot about oh, this food. They used to have those spicy wing challenges all the time. <laughs> you had to sign waivers. Then you get a picture. <laughs> Let's get one more here. I entered one uh, food eating contest and it was a bad idea. Um, pizza. So it was a $70 pizza. We had our friends pay for it. It was in college. Me and another buddy split it. I had him choose the toppings. Another mistake there. Uh -oh. He did the Hawaiian ham and pineapple. Ooh. I think we each had like three slices. We're like pretty full. Can't, can't, really, can't really do anymore. There's still like 20 minutes left. There's a 45 minute um, time limit. Pigeon stretch uh -huh. here, back leg straight, leg across. Yes, that one was going to happen. Not my kind of forte. But, yeah, that Joey Chestnut, he's a Bay Area guy, San Jose State alum. He's the uh, – what is that? The the hot dog eating championship. One half July 4th. I don't remember what it's called, though. Huh. He keeps breaking it. He keeps breaking the records. He's like 70 hot yeah. dogs. It's unbelievable. Oh. It's not healthy. No. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, how does his body do it? It's, it's, it's a, a miracle. All right. Other side. I remember they had the uh, Kobayashi guy. He was the Japanese guy. But he had like a six-pack, and he would just go to those all-you-can-eat sushi places and just put down – Plates, plates, plates. You know, had the little spinning thing. He would just take them down. Huh. Training, training, Rick. That's it's endurance. Yeah. It's another type. But yeah, buffets. Could they be a thing of the past with COVID? I mean, that <laughs> sounds like the furthest thing for so many reasons, right? Yeah. Sizzler. Sorry. No, thank you. Yeah. No dino nuggets. All righty, here we go. All right, let's go plank to down dog here. Straight arms, straight legs. Pike the hips up. Drive those heels down. And then right back down. All right. Yeah, it's like sneeze guards, right? I mean, what if someone's just like really short or really tall? I mean, either way, you're getting through on that. Yeah, there was one, the last kind of salad bar buffet that we used to go to was, was it Sweet Tomatoes? They had a few of those. Yeah. Vegetarian stuff. We used to go there a lot. There you go. It's out of business. <laughs> That's it. No moss. Yeah, you can't just, put, even the, yeah, even the Whole Foods um, salad bars there. I used to have, make my Noah's Ark salad. So that's one of every every kind of uh, vegetable they have. Uh, yep, yep. Or two, right? There's two. You have to have at least two to continue the species. That makes sense. They came back with their 
salad bar. Oh, there you go. Look at that. Whole Foods, Pioneers. All right, folks. Good deal. Let's go for a hip flexor stretch. It's because they got the uh, they got the Jeff Bezos Amazon sponsorship there. They're, those guys are doing great. Hips underneath. Crunch it down. Lean forward. Lean back. First set. I kind of like the idea of having the hands on the stomach here. Crunch down. So you have your core engaged, butt tight. Lean forward, lean back, keep it active. Lean the glute as tight as you're rocking forward and back. Let's see. Good. All right, so what would it be? Uh, 20, 2046, something like that for the, the axis. Uh, I'm not a mathematician here. Uh, 50. Where are we going to be during the axis oh, yeah. 50? It's going to be yeah. huge. All right. Other side here. Same, same. But just enjoying the present, right? Ted Lasso. Every day is a gift. That's why they call it the present. <laughs> forward and back here. Tuck under. Keep rocking. Forward and back. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> That's cool. I, I like that one. That was Zay. That's not me. Ted Lasso. Apple Plus. It was worth it. Seven day trial. We ran through it. Waiting for more. Brilliant idea, though. You know, you got the Southern guy, you know, the whole Born to America thing. Then you take him out. Now he's in the UK. Whoa, what's he going to do? And then um, ties it all together. It's good stuff. All right, folks, here we go. Round two here. Back to that line leg raise here. This time, let's go a little bit more. Contract, relax. That's that leg raise. Or foot supported around that leg. Push down, push, push, push. And then lift up. Push, 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 push into that strap down towards the ground or into your hands and then lift up. It's about five of those very active leg raises. We can, you can push a little bit more, meaning drive down a little more and then really think about lifting that leg even higher there. So that first one's a little more active, moving forward and back. This one's a little more contract and relax. There we go. Last one. Good, and let's hold there. All right, three, two, one, and switch it there. Good deal. All righty, October, so that means big holidays coming. Got the, uh, what, we got Indigenous Peoples Day, Monday. Then we got the Halloween, of course, Thanksgiving, all the good stuff. Push, 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 and lift here. It's exciting. Good. Push, push, push. Back up. Here we go. Two more there. Got to think of a couple Halloween costume ideas here. I'm open for suggestions. It was a blow up unicorn last year. The ones where you have the uh, the fan inside and it, and it poofs it out. Alrighty, good stuff, folks. So cross that leg across your body there, keeping that toe up. Now we got the glute, outer thigh. Same idea, except you're pushing up or into the strap or across into your knee there. So push, 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 and then relax. About five of those here. Push, push, push. Relax. It's about three seconds. Contract. Push, 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 and then relax. About another three. Let's get two more there. With the goal of getting a little bit more range of motion each time there. Here we go. One more. We got it. There we go. All right, folks. Other side. 
Same, same. Straight leg, smash the leg down, cross the leg over. Again, it's that contract into the strap or into the hand that's pushing across the knee there. Keeping the other toes straight up. Press, 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 and then relax it there. Five of those. Keep it going. All right, very good. One more. Awesome. There you go. Good. Let's see if you go face down here. Rotate. And then quick press up. You're up for that cobra. And then sit back towards that child's pose stretch there. Flats, shoulders, if you can. Palms face up towards the uh, sky or the ceiling there. Long inhale, even longer exhale there. And then thinking about pressing those hands, karate chopping down into the ground and then relaxing there. Karate chop down, press, press, press. Come back up, press, press, press. And then let off. And if you can, think about lifting or raising that hand alternating each time off the ground while keeping your butt back towards your heels there. Righty, good. Let's cycle back into that cat cow here. Flex and extend. Extend, head up. Chin up, eyes up. Incorporate it all together. And then flex, toes tucked hips underneath, and then alternating that or rotating between those two positions here. Inhale, and exhale there. Inhale, and exhale there. All right, one more there. And then exhale in there. Good stuff. All right, folks. Good. So if you go back to the uh, plank to down dog, you can go straight arms, hands splayed out to so get them wide into the ground. Straight legs, butt tight, abs tight, long spine. Pike it up, drop those heels down, lift the toes off the ground there. Think about that. At the same time, driving those heels into the ground and then back to that plank position, solid. Then we're back up. Inhale and exhale here. Back down. Go for three more of these. Inhale, heels drop, breathe. Back down. Go one more here. Driving those hips up, pushing those heels down here. And then right back. Nice work, folks. Good. We'll go back to the uh, pigeon stretch here one more time. So you're trying to have hands down, back leg straight, leg across the body as much as you can. If you got that, pivot, lean into that side. That's still easy. Elbows on the ground. Sit into that hip, but try to keep that back leg straight there. And then breathe. Yeah, the 25 was definitely the highlight yeah. of my day, if not month, year, etc. <sighs> Got a nice, like, cruising flat tire. I was just coming into work here. Just like, Err! and then middle field, boom, boom. Uh. Low tire pressure. Am I going to make it? Am I going to your heart's racing here? It's 545. Do I get the Phil's coffee still? No, I should just park <laughs> <laughs> so I did that. Worked out fine. It was good. Made it. Other side, and I had some some trusty trainers let me know that my tire was flat, which I did appreciate. You know, I knew it was flat, but it's good. It's good to have the confirmation. What if I didn't? What if I didn't know? It's good. Uh, good cover and move. Good awareness there. Did you find out what caused the flat? 
Uh, I think it, so they, they said it was just um, a rip on the side. So I just oh. really nailed a, uh, a, a pothole there on middle field. Huh. But luckily it was a rear tire. Subaru got, you know, had the, uh, the, uh, the spare in the back. You know, that's, I was just coming from the, uh, the tire shop right oh. before this. So that was, it was amazing. It was great. It was the first time it, it took shorter than I anticipated. It was, it was awesome. Otherwise I was anticipating, you know, sip and stretch. I got to, you guys would have seen me in my car. <laughs> Hard just, it would have been all neck stretches. That would, that would have been it. All right, folks, good work. So, you know, it all, it all worked out, panned out well. Let's get the uh, hip flexor stretch here. One leg forward, one back. Lucky. You could have said, so, today we're going to focus on stretches you can do while we're driving. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> hey, let's get the neck retractions going. Yep. Side. Special feature. <laughs> get, it, get it where you can. Go ahead and breathe. This time, let's get a reach, reach up, go across, inhale, and exhale. Rick, I was thinking, there's a guy out there, even crazier than you, Rick. I didn't think it was possible, but it's true. They have this guy, and he even, you know, just, just about the same amount of buffness as you. Um, he did uh, 50 marathons. You probably know about this already, right? In uh, mm -hmm. 50 states in 50 days, oh. this is like, and he and he gets this brilliant idea. It's going to switch sides after he does 30 marathons or 30, you know, Ironmans in 30 days. Sorry, oh. it was Ironmans to correct. So he's like, after he, right when he finishes that, he's like, he's like, that just wasn't enough, you know. I just <laughs> I needed needed more of a challenge. That's always what people ask. I'm sure Rick, you know, it's, it's the big why, right? Why do you do this, right? Dude. Why climb Everest, right? Some people are. You know, just because it's there to challenge myself to see who my limits are. You know, for me to get some alone time, you know, whatever it may be, yeah. <laughs> whatever it takes. No, but I think it, it is, you know, I think it could be all those things at the same time. And yeah, you definitely get in a, in a certain zone, I think, from that. It all right, folks. 50 that's unbelievable one yeah. is, is is like a life achievement you're like you know good job 50 is this whole other thing let's go feet wide yeah i mean i already think you know working out for that amount of time reaching like you're obviously you know just like with a lot of elite athletics or high performance you know the where you live rick you know it's not there's a difference between like what's what's health and what's like what we're doing for performance, right? There's going to be a different thing because I think there's an intersection there for sure, but you're making trade-offs at certain points. Yeah. Like for me, when, you know, when I'm having a, a ginger ale and some lays while I'm jogging along in the, uh, on a path, yeah, it's not, it's not the healthiest thing hour seven, but you know, <laughs> it, it's, it's, you know, it's, it's a fun way to push it as an event and yeah. you know, it's, it's its own thing. In that respect, here let's go on the side here. I'm a big moderation in moderation. Yeah. Right here on the side, reach across, inhale and exhale. I have, I have some fun on the edges. Good. Keep the breathing going. This one, side stretch. We got the inner thigh here. We're just doing one set of these seeing how we feel with the, with the these are the usual sip and stretch moves after doing those other ones sometimes they transfer over here other side reach across breathe it out i right, get a nice little sunset now this is, this is awesome that's that's all nature right there folks there's no there's no ring light happening here it's the real deal <laughs> Inhale and exhale there. Breathe. All right, folks, then let's go for that long sit here. So legs straight, reach those heels, coming forward towards the toes, in and out. Long, deep breath in. 
even longer exhalation out, reach for it. So we got hamstrings, you got calf, you got lower back. If it's painful, I would bend one leg if you're good. Keep reaching for it, keep breathing. Let's get a few more there. But yeah, to get the uh, the whole tire change thing was the fr the only part that was an ordeal was making the call, which I'm not like a, a call, I'm not a call person. I avoid calls at all costs. And then, you know, when it's when it reinforces your previous thoughts, meaning this is gonna take forever, it makes it so much worse. So just you know, just like with tech, right? You want technology just to work. You want that uh, Comcast fiber just to just to just to do it, right? And then when it <laughs> does, you're like, what what's going? You shaking the TV, you know? It, I do miss the days of the analog, right? You can just hit the TV a couple times, <laughs> jar it. It's, you know, or you grab the cartridge, you do the blowing thing. It made, it made so much sense. Get the dust off. All right, folks, here we go. Last time we'll go for the uh, splits here or just the deeper hip flexor stretch here, front splits. Gone are those days so of the floppy disk. Wow. Those are great. Long inhale, even longer exhale here. But I do, do appreciate the, the new tech here. I get to hang out with you guys in this like time tiny little screen it's resting on a kettlebell because i forgot my uh my stand at access so it works all right i'm just and i'm a little bit afraid of grabbing the phone because it's on top of this chair it's sitting outside that may or may not have had a black widow on it i don't know i feel like there's a lot of other spiders that look like black widows that aren't because they know they know we fear them I got this one the other the day, season. though. This is it. It's the spider season. Is it? Oh, my God. Yeah. I knew it. They're out. There's all this time for Halloween. People keep posting things on Facebook. What <laughs> is this? What kind of spiders? <laughs> are you kill you? <laughs> yep, that's it. I don't know. I think I think you just you take one of these. Wow. Mallory doubted my my skills but you know i showed her i did almost lose one the other day though i hit it flipped it over wasn't there threw it back down felt the heebie-jeebies ran inside <laughs> grabbed one of those claws and then i slowly flipped it back over and it was in the corner so i was you know i just, just didn't see it it's intense though heart was racing all right here we go last stretch to there hands behind the back Shoulders, pull them down. Spider removal, that's one of my, my new uh, services. Get ready for it. If you injure them and they survive, you're bad. Oh, <laughs> it's so much worse. Yeah, so much they worse. Get all their friends. Cousins. Don't get them mad. <laughs> Up and down, let's get a few of those. And then side to side. Yeah, we set a record last year. Last year was, I think, 13 or 14 kills. Not that Ooh. Mallory and I keep track. We had a lot. There's, there's a lot back here. Hmm. It's COVID. It's COVID year. A lot of Black Widow. What kind of spider is this? <laughs> there's probably an app for that. There has to be a spider ID. <sighs> Gotta be. All right, folks. Shake it out. Ooh, kept you guys an extra minute. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. Happy 25 access. Woo. You too.